all that boys and girls i hope you had a great week last week and that you enjoyed el cinco de mayo and spent time visiting with your family enjoying some mexican food and maybe listening to some spanish music too i sure wish we could have had our festival this year but don't worry we'll make it really special next year we are fast approaching the end of the year and we're about to be in the season of summer. In Spanish, summer is verano. And today we're going to be listening to a story about things that we like in the summer. And when we finish, I'll explain the activity that I'm sending home for you. So, the book is called En el verano, In the summer, me gusta. In Spanish, me gusta means I like. So we're going to see the things that I like to do or you like to do. Me gusta ir de acampar. I like to go camping. And when the weather's really nice and not too hot, that's a fun activity to do. Me gusta volar cometas. I like to fly kites. On a windy day, it's so fun to do that when you have a big open space. Me gusta jugar a la pelota. I like to play with the ball. And these are always fun to play with in a swimming pool or at the beach because they're so light to toss. Me gusta andar en patineta. I like to ride on a skateboard. And some of you might have those at your house and you like to do that. Next up, me gusta nadar. I like to swim. Whether your pool is above the ground or in the ground or that you swim at the beach. We all like to swim. And finally, this is one of our favorites. Me gusta comer helado. I like to eat ice cream. So expressing your likes in Spanish through explaining things and talking about things of summer is kind of fun. So what Miss Ford's sending home with you this week is this little wheel. It says, En el verano me gusta. In summer, I like to. And what you get to do is cut this part out and lay it on top of this one that has these triangles. And where you see those triangles, you get to put in the things from our story. For example, ir a campar, volar cometa, jugar a la pelota. Those were all the things we just talked about. You can color them and glue them onto this page. And you'll notice on this page, there's even a few more, comer helado, Nadar, andar en patineta. I'm even sending along another one. In case there's some things that you think of that you want to add, you could add them here and look up how to say them in Espanol. So look for these three pages that are coming home with you and listen to Ms. Ford read that book again so that you can pronounce those expressions in Spanish. I hope you guys have a great verano, and I'll look forward to seeing you maybe over the summer, but for sure in Agosto when we come back to school. Adios amigos. Goodbye friends. See you soon.